What's up, me lads, buccaneers, pirates, and seamen of the world, and welcome back to Atlas. Last episode, we managed to construct this beauty, the Anti Serenity, and uh, well, we constructed a Gibtus Refuge, which is um, all the way over there. And since then, I have captured Ramonier Enclave, and right now, I have made my way to the Bright Bur um, Bright Dun Islands. But, but, I'm not gonna actually, like, conquer this island, I just wanted to discover it. This island is way too complicated, like, the pirate bases, like, I don't know where any of them are. I scout through the entire island, there are none anywhere. So instead, what we're gonna do, we are gonna go around this island, and we're gonna conquer that, um, green island that has, like, a foot for, like, a, uh, reverse peninsula. I, I hope you guys know what I'm talking about. It's like right there. So we're gonna go that way. But first, I noticed something while I was about to start the recording. Let's go into steering. There was something over here. It's gonna move on. It's gonna take a while. There we go. There it is. Yes! Finally, we can give this uh, ship an actual battle test. These are ships of the damned. See that little green dude right there? Those are ships of the damned. Ghost ships, basically. But I know there is more than just that. Yep, there's some more. Let's go ahead and take this boy on, shall we? Okay, yep. My ship already knows of the target, but I'm not gonna start firing yet. Because I am in no means in decent range. Besides, I think the ship's already gained some broadside anyway. Raise the cannons. Fire and ready. Fire. Oh. There's one sunk. All right, looks like we got our brigand brigand team closing in our location. Let's move. direction we should find the remaining damned ships so where are they I swear they're somewhere this way okay bring down the weird I swear I saw them somewhere oh there's one 
like it's a brigantine class. Just from what I can tell. Alright. Let's get hell on pursuit. Let's just hope there's not more of them. Oh, he's trying to get away, I think. Oh, never mind. He knows I'm here. Alright, just get ready for targeting. Alright, cannons. You know what the target. Fire and ready. Wow, that was quick. Alright, well we got some sick loot. Well, that was pretty sick. This music is definitely helping. I love this music so much. It is just so cool. Nah, screw you, crew members. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna nick your stuff. Yeah, bye. All right. Alright, so we'll be sailing past the Bright Dumb Islands and we'll be making our way to whatever island that one is. Yeah, that'll be the plan. Alright, let's just go check on the crew. Everything should be fine. Oh, wait, never mind. That guy was originally gone. <laughs> Uh, from when I captured that, um, Enclave, when I captured the Enclave, we lost a soldier, and uh, we lost someone, so I kind of had to, um, leave that one unmanned, unmanned until I returned to the main docks to get more crew. Which kind of sucks. What is this? Oh, it's a bunch of stuff. Okay, give me. I know for a fact the ship's gonna need this. <gasps> okay, that's a lot of ships at the dams. <laughs> oh my goodness! What the heck? Okay, transfer all resources we need to get back to command. Oh my gosh! What the? <laughs> Okay, I count two brigantines. It looks like a schooner, but it's like an orange one as well. That's a pretty high level. Uh, oh, okay. Cannons at the ready. Make that two schooners. One of them is a pretty high level. Zoom fire. Wait, I just realized we're kind of wasting ammo, aren't we? Brace.
now we're going in the opposite direction that we need to. Okay. So this ship can possibly save, but it's not as bad as I thought it would, to be honest. Alright, now we got some more loot to get, so let's go ahead and just get some of that. Well, that battle was intense, for sure. All right, yeah, cannons down. We'll be fine for now. We just need um. So he tells me we should dock at the islands real quick, just so my crew can actually repair the vessel, or at least what they can. I mean, it's been some good loot so far, so I'm just gonna mix some of this. Just absolutely trample the crew. There we go. And sails up. Missed the thing. <laughs> okay, turn on the dime. There we go. We good. Oh, and yeah, we catch the wind, so yeah, we're good. Now we can turn a lot better as well. one. Alright, we on the move. Okay, and because it's daytime, we shouldn't really have to deal with any ships to damned, as far as I know. Alright, so I think this, yeah, the sail needs repairs. We need to actually get to this. Yeah, we need to repair the sails. Yeah, repair sails. There we go. Let's check these sails. And of course, there's more. <laughs> If they come near us, we'll attack. If not, we'll leave them alone. I just want to repair what we can. I think the hull is my main concern. I don't really care about like much else. I just want to repair the hull. Oh, I missed. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take this ship to a shipyard. I'm gonna have to take this to like a dockyard in order to like fully repair this thing. They're just making it worse for me, aren't they? Oh yeah, this one needs some repairs. I don't know why I'm letting the ship move freely on its own without me at the helm, but... I trust that she's going the right way, because I steered her in the right way. Yeah, her back took like a major hit. Now, what's our status? Yep, we should be going right past the island, and we just passed the ships that damned. Alright, we're good. I can keep repairing. Oh wait, hold on, is this repairing the same thing?
Wow, the back really took some hits. Holy crap. Alright, I think we're in the clear. Yeah, everything else should be fully repaired. Yeah, I think we're in the clear. We did lose some railings, but to be honest, it's not really that big of a concern for me. But I will repair them. Oh, wow, a sun. <laughs> uh, wow, that sun. That is a, a beautiful sun. One way you can really tell, like, just on a visual standpoint, if ships are, uh, if, like, certain parts of a ship need repairs is if, like, they get darker. Like, um, see this one? This one is fully, like, fully healed. Like, there's no damage taken to it go to this one where it's like 600, uh, like uh, at least 600 health. Well, 700 now, now that I'm repairing it. But basically, uh, you can tell by the color if they've taken a lot of damage or a little bit of damage, or no damage at all. You got my point. This isn't how you normally repair it, I just like doing this because it kind of, I think it makes them repair faster as far as I know. Oh no, these ones are fine, this one could use some repair. This one definitely needs some repair. Alright, yep, everything should be fine. This one took a bit of a couple hits. Oh, yeah. real quick, because from the loot that we got, there should be a crate somewhere, right? Never mind, apparently not. Huh, I honestly thought there'd be a crate, and there'd be a uh, loot crate somewhere. Like, uh, yeah, when you loot, you should get a loot crate, at least it's from what I know. Oh wow, we already passed the island, it took that long to repair most of the ship. But at least we are fully repaired now, everything's fine. Luckily. <laughs> Are we even heading the right direction? Hold on. Let me get to the ship. No, we're not. We need to stir a bit to the left, I think. Yep, there we go. Now we're heading the right way. Just gotta turn a little bit more. Yep, we're good. Now, to re Oh yeah, hold on. These railings also need repairs from the looks of it. I'm just gonna click and just kind of repair them. There we go. Um, these ones are fine, thankfully. Yeah, if anything took like the most amount of damage, it's definitely the uh, definitely the flooring. <laughs> but weirdly enough, this flooring really has it. Oh wait, never mind. There we go. Really enough, a separate flooring need to be uh, repaired as well. Interesting. Okay. I think we're all good now. Now we're good. <laughs> now I'm gonna put in a quick code so we can get. I think this is the code. There we go. Just gonna get some common. And we're just gonna. There we go. It's like it never got destroyed. Oh yeah, and apparently when it's like almost about to be completely destroyed, it turns like a darkish, like dark oak wood, which is, I kind of like that kind of setup where it's like, if it's slight, it like, depending on the damage, it looks different, which means you can add some luck. Oh, we're about to uh, enter the next section. Ooh, let's do this. Brace yourselves. We're about to enter the new sector. That's my pirate accent. It's very bad, I am aware. Alright, we are entering to C8. Ooh, please don't crash on the game. There's literally not much here. Come on. 
Traveling to region 1A. Wait, I thought it was C8. <laughs> Alright, so this island... Pretty mountainous, but we can make it. This island does look pretty nice, though. Not gonna lie, this island looks nice. And I think, yep, the other island is also right there, so we can also take that sector if we really wanted to. I think it's a desert island, too, so that could be pretty cool. What is that? Huh. Never mind. Alright, luckily the wind is, well, the wind's against us, but if we steer it the right way, we are with the wind and yet not with the sea. It's very, it's very weird. Alright, status and repairs. Well, these are just game add in, so we should be fine. Oh, I guess this could be used in repair. Well, I guess we can officially say that this ship can take on ghost ships and win. <laughs> not many ships get to say that. Not many um, pirates get to say they killed a ghost. Because it's kind of impossible. You can't really kill a ghost. Because they're kind of already dead. Same thing with like, the skeletal people and like uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. You can't kill them because they're, de they're already dead. Alright, so we're gonna head to that, like, little reverse peninsula right there. We're gonna try our best to get docked in there. Uh, okay. Um. <laughs> Might as well end off this episode on a good note. Let's attack them. Okay. That's a lot of big boys. Uh, I'm not gonna make that joke. <laughs> Okay, fire. Actually, no, do not fire when ready. Finally, the winds are with us today. That's the fire now. <gasps> okay. Oh, you want to play that game, don't you? Yeah, that's right. You don't want to mess with me. I've already dealt with more of your kind than you can think of. I am not scared of you. Fire. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Fire. Okay. Looks like someone wants a piece of this. Fire! Should be a direct hit. Oh, that it was. Fire. Alright, that's a galleon. Alright. Woo! It's a level 2 one, but that's still pretty powerful. Fire! Okay, we got a half health. Gonna be a big one. Ooh, fire! Alright, now all that's left is a schooner. Not anymore. <laughs> okay, yeah, bit of a miss. Bit of a swing in the miss, for sure. Alright, we're in firing range. Fire. So the wind is actually on our side today. It's supposed to flash. All 
right, wind's on our, uh, wind's about to move to our side. All right, there we go. It's gonna move on. Nope, we cannot enter through. Oh, that sucks. Okay, there might be... Wait, what? What's going on? Oh, wait, hold on. My vessel isn't sinking, what are you talking about? Damaged planks, where? Where's the damaged planks? Okay, get us out of here. All right. Now I don't know where these damaged planks are, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna unseat you, unseat you, unseat you, unseat you, unseat you. Unseat you. Unseat you. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it's all the way at the back of the ship. Alright, that's fine. I think I can reach that anyway. Yep, I can. I don't understand why it's attacking that, but okay. He will be fixed. Fix. Fix all. Oh. Fix. There we go. Alright, so we, are you guys not going to actually repair the vessel, or what, wait, like, what are you guys? <laughs> Alright, so on that note, let me just get into first person, there we go, or whatever. If you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to slash that like button with your rapier, and blow up that subscribe button with your flintlock. I will see everyone next episode. Stay salty.